Jersey numbers in college sports have always been a big deal, especially in college football. Never really understood it growing up, but as I got older, I kind of understood like, okay, well, I guess there's certain meanings behind the numbers that they pick. Well, this is the story of how I got jersey number 45 when I was playing for the Gators. This was a story that I've been skeptical about talking about because it's honestly kind of embarrassing. And the fact that I have a story about getting my jersey number is kind of wild. So for this, we got to backtrack to about June of 2019. So at this point, I'm about a week in the program, had a couple workouts, a couple meetings, still getting introduced to everybody. As the days went on, I just started just randomly thinking about, I don't have a jersey number yet. I just started looking at numbers one day and just kind of made assumptions like, oh, okay, this isn't taken, this isn't taken. So I just ran with the assumption of number 82. No, seriously, like I literally made one Gator fan page, make me a graphic with the number 82 on it. Shout out to Gator Chomp, OG Gator page. Some of y'all might be too young for that. And then about a week or so later, uh, Gators football, they tweeted uh, the 2019 roster. So I'm looking. I looked for about five minutes. My name was nowhere to be found. So then it hit me, I was like, I better talk to someone about getting a jersey number. So I went over to EQ and I was just like, hey guys, uh, I noticed uh, I don't have a number yet. It's not a big deal to me, but uh, could I you know, maybe pick a number? And then they said, have you talked to Coach Mullen? And I was like, no, I didn't even know I had to talk to him. And they were like, yeah, make sure you talk to Coach Mullen. So was I scared to talk to Coach Mullen? Damn right. Was I scared to ask him for a number? A hundred percent. But me being the bold guy that I am, I just sent him a text and it said, Hey Coach Mullen, it's Clifford Taylor the fourth. Walk on tight end. Don't know why I had to tell him that. I just got told by the equipment guys that I had to go grab a jersey number from you and or one of our personnel guys. You wanna know what numbers I asked for? 14 and 34. Why 14? I don't know, it just sounded cool. Actually, now that I think about it, the reason I chose 14 was because the guy who wore it last year, Lucas Crow, was going back to number seven. And so I was like, oh, okay, 14, you know, I guess it's a tight end number. That'd be cool. And the only reason why I said 34 was because that was my, my high school number when I was playing basketball. So I just figured, okay, you know, both are available. I'll hopefully maybe get one or the other. Any guesses what Coach Mullen said? Yeah, he left me on red never responded. And I noticed that number 82 was gonna be taken by one of our freshman receivers at the time, Jamarcus Weston. And number 80 at the time was taken by receiver Trent Whittemore, who was also a freshman. So now I'm like, what number am I gonna get? So I go back in the facilities one day and EQ calls me and they're like, hey, you know, we need to get you, get you a number. And I was like, oh, great, finally. So they gave me four options. Any guesses what those numbers were? The numbers were 38, 43, 45 and 49. Yeah, and guess what numbers were still available? <laughs> Crazy, right? But nonetheless, I picked out of the four and I just stuck with. Now the number 45 didn't have any special meaning to me, you know, not a family member, you know, played in 45. The only reason I picked 45 is because four or five is my birthday, April 5th, so it just kind of made the most sense. So yeah, that's how I got my number. And this is what I looked like during my first media day. I'm pretty sure EQ just grabbed the biggest pads they could find and just threw it on me. And this was how I looked my senior year. As you can tell, I got a lot built, a lot bigger. I actually look more like a football player here. So guys, that's the story and I'm sticking with 45 the rest of my life. Go Gators!